Okay, this is a quick how-to video on how to take um, a 12-volt, 30-amp power supply or something close to that and uh, wire it up for um, rep wrapping or whatever you want to do with it. So basically, we've got we've got the power supply here. Um, right here, you see you got live, neutral, and ground. Um, this is where you'll actually need to plug in like a PC power um, cable because um, that'll go into the wall for these three right here. Um, so basically the way you do this is you take a PC power cord, um, so you know, standard PC power cord, and you cut off, uh, not this end, not the prong end, but you cut off the other end. So so here's the end I've cut off here. And you, you can see I stripped the wire here because I'm, basically what you need to do is, is, is if you look real close you see you have a, a, a N, 1, and an L. So and next to the one you see the ground sign and those actually match up uh, with your neutral live and ground so what you do is you take your multimeter uh, so I have a multimeter right here and you put it on this uh, resistance setting here or the uh, I don't know what it's, I don't even know what the name of it is but basically you put it on the, the setting that's going to send a current through because you want to find out um, where the flow is going so you stick one one end of the prong and um, any one of these holes really just start with the neutral so I put it in the end, and then take the other end of the prong, and you wait to find out which wire you get a reading. And then that tells you which wire goes with the end, and likewise with the uh, live and the ground. So you're putting the multimeter on one end, and you're checking each cable on the other end uh, to find out, you know, which which color goes with which. And so once you figure that out, all you need to do is you you pop open the top here, and you'll wire each one of these. So like in this case, the uh, I think the green was the ground. I forget off the t yeah green green is the ground, and brown is live and blue is neutral. And that's for this one. It, it color codes should always be the same, but definitely check with your multimeter because you don't want to um, start a fire or destroy a perfectly good power supply. So um, basically, what I'll do is I'll wire each one of these up here, not in that order, but they get wired up, screwed in, and then um, you know the power supply is good to go. 